It reminds me of the Queen of Hearts in Alice in Wonderland. There you go, Queen of Hearts. Not a queen yet, but you're working on it. guys and welcome to another episode of Bubba's Garage. Today is going to be a busy day. We've got a lot of running around to do and when I say running around I got to go between the garage and the backyard. I got to help Bobby and Shelby do the headboard thing from the other day. They weren't able to finish that. They ran into some obstacles. If you guys haven't seen that video please check the eye in the sky. I'll leave that link right up there. Outside of that I'm going to go to the garage because I need to prep those brackets so I can put them back on my Jeep because I'm not going to lie. My Jeep doesn't look very fly without my brackets on my Jeep. I miss my light bar. So, Bobby, Shelby, well, they're still in bed. It's kind of quiet around here. So, I got up like at 5 a.m. and started editing vlogs. Got yesterday's vlog uploaded. So, I hope you guys really enjoy that. Now, well, I'm going to go have a cup of coffee with Odie. Oh, it's still too early to start grinding on the brackets out in the garage. I just don't want to wake up all my neighbors. So I guess I will wash the humidity off of this bed frame. That way I feel like I'm productive this morning. All right guys, I don't know if you guys can see this, but right in here where all the, where all the tape was at, it peeled the paint, the spray paint up, so it created like this texture on it. So that is where the problem comes in. So I'm gonna go ahead and sand this down a little bit and clean it back up again and uh, get it ready for paint. Babe's awake. Yay. Oh crap, that means I'm not gonna get anything done. Ugh. I love you too. Just picking. Means mm -hmm. I have a good helper. <laughs> I try. Well, if you really think about it, you did screw it up the last time. Got it wrapped up. We're putting our paint on it. Guys, that was a booger bear to tape up. And honestly, we probably shouldn't have used the whole saran wrap thing. We probably should have just taped the whole thing and the whole bars, but I was looking for an easy way to take it off because when we go to take this off, this thing is kind of hanging and dangling and yeah, it makes it hard to take off. But we're getting our coat on it. So hopefully in about 15 minutes, we're gonna start taking that stuff off and we're gonna let this thing sit up for a couple of hours. All right, guys, we made it right here in Bubba's garage, finally. The headboard wasn't too bad. I mean, it was a pain in the butt to tape up and a pain in the butt to untape, but in the end, I think it panned out all right. I think it looks a lot better. I would agree. We have that hanging up out back. We're going to let it hang for a couple hours, and then we're going to bring it inside. We're going to have to. We got rain headed this way. So, meanwhile, we're going to go ahead and get started and see if we can't strip some of this old paint and rust and stuff like that off these brackets. Probably won't paint it today, but then again, this is Bubba's Garage, you just never know. So let's see what happens. But man, I'll tell you what, I've been at this for a little over an hour now. I got most of this side completely done. I got about this stuff to do. Um, a little bit more freshening it up on this side, and this one will be uh, pretty much ready for paint. And then I'll move on to the other one. So uh, it honestly looks like I might have another couple of hours if you include detailing it. This is a lot of flipping work. All right guys, just a quick update. Four hours into this, got one bracket completely done, just needs a little bit of touch up stuff. Still gotta continue going on this bracket. I'm not gonna lie, it's probably gonna take me another two to four hours. It's taking a little bit longer than I thought, but it's about this garage, it's just what we do. Been using the compressor so much that it filled up with water. Ah. guys I hope you guys had a fabulous day unfortunately my day hasn't gone so well I mean the whole headboard thing went really really well but this whole bracket thing unfortunately I mean guys it's 4 30 I started on the brackets at 9 30 and I still have yet to fine-tune every aspect of these brackets I'm kind of burnt out I'm kind of tired hey on a positive note check this out got one of them done he's nice he's lubed up and oiled up he's ready for paint he really is. I got one more I'm almost done with, but I'm just, uh, I'm burnt out. I'm burnt out. The compressor has been running all day. I need to give it a break, let it air out, let all that water come out of the system. Yeah, I'm just burnt out.
It reminds me of deck of cards. It reminds, uh, it reminds me of the Queen of Hearts in Alice in Wonderland. There you go, Queen of Hearts. Not a queen yet, but you're working on it. <laughs> I really like it. It really pulls the other furniture together. Yeah, it looks pretty good. I like it. Good job. Looks like a so, matching set. First episode of Fell. We'll call this one a success. Do a we success. agree? Mm -hmm. Good? You good. Got, got Bubba it. saves the day. Again, guys. Again. So that wasn't too bad, right? I mean, Bobby and Shelby had some problems with the headboard in the very beginning. And, you know, it's going to happen, right? I mean, this is Bubba's garage. Sometimes things go great. But most of the times, there's a fail. There's always a fail in there. I think it turned out really, really good. In my honest opinion, I like it. I mean, it reminds me a little bit of Alice in the Wonderland, you know, maybe a deck of cards kind of thing. But outside of that, not too shabby. Now, I've been working on those brackets 99.9% .9 of the day, guys. I'm really tired of working on the brackets. And, you know, I learned from Bobby and Shelby's mistakes. I'm going to take my time. I'm going to do it right because I do not want to take those brackets off of the Jeep Wrangler in a year to repaint them. So this wraps up this episode of Bubba's Garage. If you guys like this episode, please give us a huge, huge thumbs up. If you really like this episode and you want to stick around to find out what happens next, please subscribe. And until next time, we'll see you on the flip side. Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. And honestly, there for just a moment, my heart almost fell out of my chest, man. It yeah. was really scary.